If you're a YouTuber, you're probably aware how important YouTube thumbnails are to your content. They can get you more clicks, more views, more subscribers, and all the good stuff, that YouTube growth that you've been craving. Now, did you know that YouTube have got this new feature where you can actually upload three different thumbnails and it will test traffic to each thumbnail and it'll pick out which one is the best for generating the most watch time. Now, this isn't a strategic video. This isn't to talk about how to best use that feature. This is just to look at where that feature is. How do we upload our videos and add multiple thumbnails? Because it is hidden away a little bit. So let's dive straight in. I'm gonna show you exactly how to upload multiple thumbnails to your YouTube videos. Now, a couple of things that you need to check before you actually try and use this feature. First of all, you need to use a desktop or your laptop. You can't do this on the mobile YouTube studio. Second of all, you need to add advanced features enabled. Now you do that by going into your YouTube studio, going down to settings and just click on channel and feature eligibility. Now you should have this advanced features enabled. If not, it's probably got like a verification process that you can follow. Um, it's definitely worth getting this enabled and just going through the extra steps. And you can see there, you've got test and compare different thumbnails is one of the features. So that needs to be done, otherwise this isn't gonna show for you. Now what I'll do is I'll just show you how this works with a new video. So I'm just gonna click on create and upload video and select file. I'm just gonna find a quick video that we can just drag into here. Now I'm just gonna use one of these little clips that I've got because they're tiny files and it's just for a quick demo. This is just a little bit of stock footage so I'm not actually gonna publish this. So we click on upload as normal. You'd put your title in as normal, your description in as normal and if you look here, it says thumbnail and you've got this option here that says test and compare. So test and compare, we're gonna click on that. And it tells us here we can upload up to three images to learn which one the viewers prefer. Now, when it says prefer, it tells you here how it works. Now you upload your images here and then you have to wait for the results, which can take up to two weeks. Now it does kind of depend on how many views you get as well in your videos. So if you wanna get a few views, it might not actually give you any meaningful results, but it's worth trying. So YouTube will basically pick the one that gets the most watch time and it'll tell you once that the results are in. So we click on this plus symbol and I've just got some sample ones here. So I'm just gonna choose thumbnail A, click on the next box, thumbnail B and last one. You don't have to upload three, you can upload two if you wish. And I think what I'm gonna start doing is testing them so that they're actually very different thumbnails. Find out which one is the best and then fine tune it and maybe run a second test as well. So once we've done, we've uploaded all M3, you can just click on these three dots in the corner and change or download it if you wish. But when I'm just gonna click on done. And as you can see, you've got this one big thumbnail here, which is kind of a split of all three of them. You would then go through, add your playlist, everything else, and just upload your video as normal. And it's as simple as that. Now, if you wanna do this to an existing video rather than a brand new one, I'm gonna quickly show you how to do that as well. So I'm just gonna go into this Canva Magic AI tool video here. And we just click on it and it opens up as if you're gonna edit that video. So this is one I updated um, a month or two ago. So if we just scroll down to the thumbnail section, you'll see it looks slightly different. Now in this thumbnail part here, if I click, if I hover over the little uh, icon for the existing thumbnail and click on them three dots, you've then got test and compare. So click on test and compare. And then we're at this same uh, image here as well. So we can click on the plus sign. We can upload our additional thumbnails and then we just click done. Save the video and then over a week, two weeks, however long it takes, depending on the number of views you get into that video, it will come back with the results, tell you which one is best, and then you can go in and just set that as the primary thumbnail. It's as simple as that. Now, if you want any more tips on video content, then make sure you subscribe and watch the video that's coming up next because it's gonna be a big help to you.